1987 was a massive year in electronic dance music. Steve Silk Hurley's Chicago classic Jack Your Body became the first house music track to hit number one on the UK singles charts. On the same chart, the Pet Shop Boys reached number one with It's a Sin. And in the fall of 1987, Depeche Mode released the instantly classic album Music for the Masses. For Manchester Heroes New Order, it was a pivotal year in more ways than one. With electronic dance music making inroads around the world, it was time to show what they've been up to since the band formed from Manchester's eternally legendary outfit, Joy Division. It's time to look back at one of the most iconic releases in New Order history, Substance 1987. I'm Scott T. Sterling, and this is The Rhino Report. It was August 1987 when New Order collected 11 of the 12 single releases to date on the classic double LP, Substance 1987. We're talking tracks like Ceremony, Temptation, The Perfect Kiss, Shell Shock. The set showcased New Order's rapid evolution from guitar-powered post-punk pioneers into sleek electronic dance music trailblazers over the course of the group's impressive singles discography. Substance 1987 was a direct hit for New Order, providing a user-friendly, all-in-one introduction to the band. It also arrived with a brand new track from New Order, True Faith. The song was a hit on both sides of the Atlantic. In England, True Faith peaked at number four on the singles chart. In America, True Faith was the first New Order track to crack the top 40, peaking at number 32 on the Hot 100. Thanks, in large part, to the eye-catching music video that was popular on MTV's late-night alternative rock series, 120 Minutes. Fun fact, the CD and cassette versions of Substance 1987 included all 12 of the band's singles, including new single True Faith, and a bevy of non-LP B-sides, totaling 24 tracks. The album features a 1981 re-recorded version of Ceremony with Gillian Gilbert, May 1987 re-recordings of Temptation and Confusion, and edited versions of Subculture, Shellshock, and Hurt. The album was especially popular on college radio and in university dorm rooms across the U.S., helping spread the New Order sound to a much wider and more mainstream audience than ever before. Fans of classic American cinema and Reese Witherspoon will also recall the iconic song True Faith playing at a bar in one of the opening scenes of Mary Heron's American Psycho. On November 10th, 2023, Rhino Records is proud to release a remastered edition of New Order's Substance 1987, with the new edition available as a 2LP, 2CD, 4CD Deluxe Edition, 2LP Color Vinyl, and a special limited edition double cassette. Also being made available are reissues of the 12-inch singles True Faith, True Faith Remix, and of course, Blue Monday 88. The 4CD version includes the original 2CD set, remastered with two additional CDs. CD3 expands the collection with alternate versions and extra B-sides. CD4 releases an unreleased concert. The blue and red colored vinyl version of Substance 1987 will be a retail exclusive, with the double cassette version exclusive to the official New Order store. Now, New Order will celebrate all things Substance 1987 with a new merch line that will include black t-shirts and a Substance 1987 poster. Let us know your favorite track on this classic New Order release. 